Hello and welcome. Thank you so much for watching. This show is all about giving you insights and showcasing brands that help you to live your best life and give you confidence. As always, I want to kickstart your morning with some motivational advice to help you to feel inspired and energized to start your day. Today, I want to talk about the importance of pursuing excellence. When we think of pursuing excellence, we think of aiming for perfection. This is a misconception. Aiming for excellence means doing things thoroughly and to 100% of the best of your ability. It's not about perfection. It's about aiming to raise the bar. The truth is, the difference between average and exceptional is the extra effort you put in between. Excellence isn't about aiming for the status quo. It's about pushing your limits through hard work and discipline to be the best version of yourself, not sometimes, but always. Excellence is about putting 100% effort into everything you do with maximum effort and focus. It's through excellence that some of the greatest leaders have made trailblazing discoveries and inventions. So how do we pursue excellence in our daily lives? Where do we start? The first step is raising your standards that you have for yourself. Make your mission today to do daily tasks to the best of your ability, whether that task is big or small. Don't do things for the sake of doing it. See things through to start to finish, giving 110% effort. And before you know it, you will find that your effort will translate into success in every area of your lives. As Perry Sexton quotes, excellence is in the details. Give attention to the details in everything you do and excellence will come. Stay tuned. Coming up after the break, I'll be doing the Halo Laser Skin Treatment. I'm really excited to come and visit you for that. So let's talk about that treatment and what can people expect after having one? Right, so the Halo Treatment is the world's first hybrid laser, which means it targets skin at the surface as well as deeper down. And there's lots of lasers that can do multiple things, but the nice part about the Halo is it does it simultaneously. And one of the things um, that is interesting is that if you took one part of it and did it and then you took another part of it and did it, it doesn't give you the same amazing result as when you do them together. There's something about that g gestalt that um, the sum of the whole is more than the sum of the parts. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? Yeah. Next on the show we have dermatologist Dr. Julia Carroll, who is the founder of Compass Dermatology. She is also the president of the Canadian Association of Aesthetic Medicine and a lecturer at the University of Toronto. Dr. Julia will be discussing Halo and BBL Hero, two new innovations by Cyton, which are taking the cosmetic industry by storm with their laser technology that addresses multiple skincare issues, including texture, tone, and pigment. Dr. Julia, thank you for being on the show today. How are you doing? I'm awesome. It's my absolute pleasure. I'm so excited. I'm excited too, and I love that you're Canadian <laughs> and you're from Toronto because a lot of our guests are from the U.S., so it's, it's great to have a fellow Canadian here today. <laughs> yeah, it, it's, uh, I'm a maritimer by, uh, you know, at heart, but I, I am based in Toronto. Dr. Julia, let's talk about your background as a dermatologist. Uh, when did you open up your practice, Compass Dermatology? So we opened up Compass Dermatology in uh, 2012, and I did that with my partner and my work wife, mm -hmm. Dr. Sonia Cook. Um, we have an amazing practice with, you know, a team of 12 people, all women, oh, really amazing cool. vibe at the clinic. Um, yeah, so we're really proud of what we've grown. Mm -hmm. And let's talk about the different services that your clinic offers. For sure, we are a both a, like a complete clinic, so we offer medical and cosmetic dermatology services. Um, in terms of specifics, you know, I think the big things that we offer are injectables like Botox and fillers, and then we're really known for our bespoke laser treatments. So we like to do lots of combinations that are individualized uh, for patients. So we do uh, custom broadband light treatments, BBL. Um, halo treatments and then other little combinations as well. Uh, we have cool sculpting, so body contouring, and then we just introduced uh, suspension thread lifts, which is new to Canada. Mm -hmm. um, but I think one of the things that we really do with our patients is one of the uh, compass values is that we partner with our patients. So we spend a lot of time sitting down with people, finding out what it is they want to do, and then we actually create what we call an annual plan. So we look at what the uh, goal is for the year, what the budget is, and what they really want to focus on, and that's been really great. Patients really appreciate having that check-in and that annual plan. 
Mm -hmm. And you mentioned Halo. Um, I'll be doing the Halo laser skin treatment. So I'm really excited about that. Obviously, after the lockdown is lifted, um, I'm really excited to come and visit you for that. So let's talk about that treatment and what can people expect after having one? Right, so the Halo treatment is the world's first hybrid laser, which means it targets skin at the surface as well as deeper down. And there's lots of lasers that can do multiple things, but the nice part about the Halo is it does it simultaneously. And one of the things um, that is interesting is that if you took one part of it and did it, and then you took another part of it and did it, it doesn't give you the same amazing result as when you do them together. There's something about that gestalt that um, the sum of the whole is more than the sum of the parts, mm -hmm. if that makes sense. Yeah. Let's talk about how the laser treatment works. Um, talk to us a little bit about the technology so our viewers know. Right. So it is this a technology where it simultaneously targets the surface of the skin, the epidermis, as well as going deeper down into the dermis. And so it will target pigmentation, fine lines, wrinkles. Um, and it's really well known for giving back the halo glow. So it's for people who um, have some aging skin and, and people that are also just looking to be preventative. Uh, the interesting thing about the technology is it's what we call tunable. So that means that you can turn it up and down based on the results that you're trying to get or the skin that you're starting with. So I have some patients that come in and say, you know what, it is quarantine. I have all the time in the world, so turn it up and you're going to get more downtime, but a better response. And other people will say, you know what, hard stop. I'm on the Daryl Roy show on <laughs> Thursday, so I can't be looking swollen or, you know, scabby. So then we're gonna turn it down. Okay, and you talked about some of the skin issues that it addresses. I know for me, I don't have aging skin, but I do have sunspots. I started developing them a couple of years ago, um, and they're very annoying, and they keep progressively getting a little bit worse uh, over time. So how can they address something like sunspots for me? Okay, well, lucky you for not having <laughs> aging skin. <laughs> not yet, not yet. <laughs> well, the good thing is Halo will actually be preventative for you. So even someone who doesn't have aging skin is going to be preventative. But for the pigmentation part, it really does target pigmentation, which lives in the epidermis. Mm -hmm. And uh, it targets the, uh, you know, the pigmented skin cells. And they get a little bit darker and then they slough off. Oh, very interesting. And you know, of course, it being a laser treatment, people are sometimes worried if it's safe. So is it safe or, and do you recommend it? Well, certainly in my hands, I find this device to be very, very safe. I'm a dermatologist. I'm trained in cosmetic dermatology. Um, and obviously our staff are really highly trained. I don't think as a doctor, I'd ever be comfortable saying that anything is 100% safe. But I think if you have um, the person operating the technology, uh, well-trained, and then you have a, a, a doctor, in this case a dermatologist, myself involved, then I think it's, you know, in my hands I found this to be a very safe device and a really comfortable device as well, a very comfortable treatment. I want to talk about the BBL Hero treatment. Walk us through the treatment and how it works. Okay, so BBL stands for broadband light, and it is a type of an IPL or intense pulse light, but it is the most powerful and most robust uh, IPL that exists in the world today. Uh, and the HERO portion of it stands for high energy rapid output. So what they've done with the technology, it used to be a stamping technology, if you got an IPL, it'd be like, hit the skin, snap, hit the skin, snap and you sort of move around the skin, a bit of a slow process. Now with this new BBL Hero technology, it's a continuous motion. So you're getting uh, more energy into the skin, it's happening quicker, and it's more comfortable because it's continuous instead of random snaps. And the nice part is it targets redness, pigmentation, so brown spots, broken blood vessels, but at the same time, because of the energy that's being delivered to the skin, you get another elevated experience, which is skin that is a little bit tighter, more toned, and it's basically just looking, acting, and feeling like younger skin. Mm -hmm. You have great skin, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I've had the BBLs and I get a halo once a year. Very nice. So let's talk about the downtime. I know you touched base on it a little bit about the downtime for both. So let's talk about the downtime for Halo and the BBL treatments. 
Right. So again, the halo is tunable, so you can turn it up and down. But, you know, for example, the first time I had a halo, um, then I got a call the next day. Someone wanted to come in and do a quick news story. And so I was able to go on camera. I was a little bit swollen. So if you knew me, you might like notice that I looked a bit swollen. But and nobody who was watching on air that night noticed I had a little bit of makeup on and I was fine. So s traditionally people that have a halo can get a little bit of swelling. Their skin is a little bit flaky as all that skin that we've targeted down below comes out into the surface and then peels off. And, um, and there can be some redness as well. So that can last anywhere from four days to two weeks depending on the level that we set. But usually you can go to the house if, like a day or two later with a bit of makeup, uh, tinted sunscreen, and you're none the wiser. No one's any the wiser. Oh. The BBL downtime is a little bit of swelling. Brown spots look really brown and they peel off, but it's considered a lunchtime procedure. So that one is, is a really easy one to do. How many treatments are recommended to really see maximum results? Right, so in terms of how many treatments to see maximum results, it really depends on where you're starting and where you want to go. It's like taking a trip. It depends on the type of skin that you have, how much sun damage you've, you, sun damage you've had over the years. But traditionally, a halo, we will recommend somebody have one to two a year, depending on their age. Um, and then people that have maybe a more complex problem, for example, like melasma, they may have three or four uh, halos just to get them to where they're happy. And then we hit maintenance phase, which again, maybe once or twice a year. For BBL Hero, uh, we usually do them in a series of four, but some people see great results after two. And if that's the case, we usually say, that's fine, buy the package, and then leave that treatment for later on in the year when you want a little bit of a refresher. So traditionally four, but with the new technology, we are finding some people getting their results a little bit quicker. Um, and But some people just love it so much that they're every eight weeks they want to come in because they just like the way that their skin feels looks and, and acts after the treatment. Mm -hmm. And what are the price points for both treatments, the Halo and BBL Hero? Right. So for the Halo, it's twelve fifty for one treatment. Mm -hmm. On average, this is at my clinic and it may differ depending on you know where you're located and um, and what country you're in. And uh, for broadband light hero, uh, we charge fifteen hundred for three and then there's a fourth one included. So essentially it's 1500 for four, uh, or if you want to buy them singly, I think it's 499, but most people go for the package. Mm -hmm. And where can people find out more information about both treatments and book their appointment? So I think Cyton.com, S-C-I-T-O-N.com is a great resource for uh, looking at the technology. If you really want to geek out on the technology of the lasers, you can access it there, compassdermatology.ca, um, is our website and you can book directly through our website if you're interested and then on my Instagram at Dr. Julia Carroll I have lots of fun videos showing different laser procedures what they're like sort of a day in the life how we do them before and after photos things like that we have a lot of fun amazing well thank you so much Dr. Julia for being on the show today and I will see you soon I'll be visiting your clinic for my halo treatments so I'm very excited so I will be seeing you soon <laughs> okay great I can't wait it's gonna be amazing all right, thank you so much. Enjoy your day. Tag TV is available on Roku, Amazon Fire TV, Apple and Android TVs, as well as on Apple and Android phones. Watch us live through YouTube and Facebook.